Okay, my name is François Taon, I'm coming from France and uh, we are here to explain to Serbian farmers uh, the interest of a French uh, sheep breed called Blanche du Massif Central. Okay, I'll just say. To je znači gospodin François, dolazi iz Francuske i njegove ideje da objasni farmerima od Srbiji koje su prednosti rase Bela Francuska misija, centralna misija. We are coming, the breed... The breed is coming from uh, the same type of area than here. I mean, hilly mountains uh, with uh, many woods and lands. Prva slipnost je što dolazi od prilike njihova teritorija gde oni gajete ovce vrlo slično ovde. Po konfiguraciji brda realno nema dobrog pašnjaka ili tako nešto. The first advantage is that the breed can, the, the ewes can have lambs all over the year, from December, January to December, and not that only one period is very good advantage. Kod mnogih ovaca, rasa, postoji taj deo koji utiče na gajanje, a to je sezonska stvar. Kod ove rase praktično taj sezonski moment gde većina se u jednom kraćem periodu jagni ne postoji. Tako da se to smatra velikom prednosti. The second advantage is they able to have a little bit less than two lambs for each lambing period. Druga prednost je što mogu da imaju u proseku po jednoj majici malo manje od dva jagnjeta u periodu jagnjenja. What can I say else? Well, it's basically very maternal. Yeah. Um, the third advantage is the mothers are very maternal, so um, they take care about the, the lambs just at the lambing, and uh, they don't leave them alone, and so they protect them, and so the lambs are very strong at the birth. Ima izražene majčinske osobine, tako da praktično farmer nema ništa da radi, sve obavlja sama majka. I naravno kao rezultat toga jako lepo napreduju i agenci i budu kad treba dovoljno jake za dalje. And the last thing, we are not here only to sell animals, but to help Serbian farmers to improve their, their production. And uh, France can help them. We need to have uh, lambs production in Europe because we import so many lambs from Oceania and uh, we prefer that they are made in Europe and far away. Dakle, ističe sva da nisu došli ovde da prodaju samo, nego da malo razgovaraju, da upoznaju farmere sa rasom. Možda ja nisam znao da Francuska i dalje mnogo je veći uvoznik jagnjećeg mesa nego što je izvoznik i oni bi radije da imaju kooperante iz Evrope nego nekih prekomorskih zemalja, što je znam, Australije.